Missed it, missed it, Donald, man, Donald. Yeah. I said, well, all the capabilities of a president. Oh, man. And I said, well. You're not doing no more rallies like you was doing before. You're not talking all the talk and the infrastructure and all that. Now you want to uh, crack down on, uh, I guess, uh, 4th of July fireworks. To be honest with you, you killed Easter, man. Once, once Easter was gone, I said, it, it pretty much ain't going to be no holidays in 2020, man. Uh, let me figure this one out, but um, mainly my fame has risen to an unbearable point. I, mean, I, I, I say unbearable to uh, to an extent, which is I didn't know. And I'm trying to figure out what can I do with all of this fame. <laughs> Cause I didn't ask for it. I didn't ask for it. Just wanted to get on, express, and it all gets taken into a clout arena. And I said to myself, well. <laughs> because I didn't know that you can actually clean roofs at 3, 4 in the morning, man. Like I said, I'm getting disturbed all types of hours in the, in the morning by individuals that want to clean roofs in the dark. <laughs> I mean, they, they pulled out a ladder, and I was like, yo, I know they not, I know they not, not, not. All night. Like, I said, well, was it the night before the last, the night before? Ah, nah. Slice wants to get his message across, whether it's direct or indirect. And like I said, Donald. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, but man, it's, it, it, the name says it all, baby. And then I said, whoever gave you that name had the right idea, bro. Definitely the right idea. Trump said, oh, should I say, Donald says, <laughs> coronavirus is going away. Nah, bro, you need it. You wanted to go away so you can start more of these rallies and things. But like I said, your last rally left a, half of them people sick, man. And like I said, your fans, your fans got a habit of coughing on, spitting on their hands and shaking other people's hands, man. Mm. Mm. I seen them. <laughs> At your rally saying, Corona ain't going to do nothing. Yeah, you see what happened to Florida. Now go down there and explain to them people what you're going to do to stop the COVID-19. And shout out to Grammarly, my sponsor, man. Stay stay up, Grammarly, man. And like I said, this is a case where you seem to have to fight fire with fire. Because the fire just won't go out. <laughs> With water. And he wants to put, the Donald wants his face on Mount Rushmore. There is not enough room for your face on Mount Rushmore, Donald. <laughs> no, man. He wants to take one of them president's faces off of there and put his face on there. 
Uh, you see the diabolicalism. We need to handle pandemics, COVIDs, reopening, cash flow. And like I said, the only option for the government is to fight the government against the government. Because one branch does things that the other branch doesn't. Well, it's been doing so for years now. So, is this the new norm, government? <sighs> Watch Local 4 News at 5, June 25th. And like I said, you got a bunch of uh, people telling you that this going to work and that's going to work. And you should try this against this and that. And I said, well, is that legal? Mm. I don't think so. Watch local news. Yeah, that's pretty much all it's on. Local news and uh, how you going to crack down on this. And like I said, the, the things aren't open 24 hours anymore. They can crack down on Except Dunkin' Donuts. <laughs> NBA player play, NBA play, NBA player pays tribute to Vince Carter following retirement news. And then I said, "Well, what if you have an emergency at a certain time at night? What do you do then?" And like I said, are you making matters greater or worse? I don't remember marrying to the government for better or for worse, man. Thought it was just the government, man. <laughs> <laughs> but it's deeper than that. It's so much deeper than that. I mean, really looking at it. Because... You said increase of pay. Now everybody out of work. You said COVID was going. It came back again. We in round two of the, of the, of the Rona, man. And the 4th of July is right around the corner. Do you, do you want to get sick after the 4th? Stimulus is the talk. Where did, where did it go? What happened to it? If, if Ripple didn't get it. <laughs> what happened to it? Uh, the world we live in. The things that we create for the future to follow. May do more harm than good. And... Like I said, this is not one of my sponsors, but he, he want to be. And every time I'm on, he pops up. Stock picks and all of that. Right, right, right. I don't, like I said, man. Polls in Wisconsin and Ohio bring good news to Joe Biden. I mean... We haven't got down to the electoral votes, but Trump wins the most. Like I said, man, is there going to be an electoral vote? So, Biden, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't uh, claim victory just yet. And uh, like I said, the youngins are enthused to, to see the punishment that Donald throws out. Amongst uh, what are we, what are we, minorities, <laughs> so don't rock me to sleep, baby. Don't rock me to sleep. You, you still got a fight to go, but I'm still trying to get in the in in the uh, in the candidate seat because I think 
that uh, I still got a few ideas up up underneath there that can remold the mess. As uh, coronavirus daily news updates, what to know today about COVID-19. It's running wild. That's what I'm in. That's what the, that's what I'm seeing on the news and all that. Running wild. And then hit the whole bottom of the U.S. like a like a like a smiley face smile. You know, it's just just that whole bottom part. Army is taking limited steps to counter racial division, divisive, divisiveness. Listen, if you're a racist. Be a racist. Embrace it. Put on. See, it wasn't like how it was back in the day when you could wear your, wear your cloak. You know, your, your white gown and all, and, and your pointy hat, and you, you know what I mean, your mask covered up. Now, like I said, man, nobody knows who's racist. You could you could turn into a racist in, in, in a matter of. Like this. And like I said, I can't control you wanting to be what you want to be. But that tends to not apply for the minorities. Kentucky 19 and Kentucky. I'm sorry, I said Kentucky 19. COVID 19 in Kentucky. Be sure. Moves from daily to weekly. Lives updates. Told you, man, it's running rapid. Running rapid. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mobile food pantry in Jackson. Saturday, locals. Listen, man, that's another thing, man. How people supposed to get to where they need to get to? Get the things necessary. Her unemployment went to two point six percent. I mean, two two million, and I mean it went from one point four million to two point four million within a week. <clears throat> you jumping a a, a a million a week in unemployment, man. That's a tragedy. I know, I know, I know you you like spending, but. You don't seem to understand that you don't have that. That's why things are late with this them and lemon lands. Late with that. And then you tell them you want to go back, you want to, want them to go to work, want to go back to work, but they have to show loyalty. Mm, mm, mm. That, my friend, is discriminative. They qualify. And let them do the job. Loyalty shouldn't have to interfere. That's that's a personal vendetta. Mm. Ooh. It's only business, man. And I think you overstepping your boundaries there, King Donald. Ooh. CDC says COVID-19 cases in U.S. may be 10 times higher than reported. Listen, man, if you let little hand, I'm, I'm sorry, Donald do the reporting, he will say there is zero numbers of COVID-19 cases at this point. That's the desperation of an individual trying to mangle his way into the 2021 presidency. But I didn't need to mangle my way in. I just think I'm a a personal, uh, uh, not a personal, but a, uh, a, uh, a patient president who's willing to, uh, listen to what the people have to say and, uh, hopefully make out some deals. Cause that's another thing, Donald. You said you was the king of deals. Look like you got us in trouble. <laughs> Trump Mount Rushmore. Nah, nah, man. No, 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 no. 
First it was the statues. Now you wanna now you wanna blow up uh, blow up blow up Mount Rushmore just to just to put your face on it. Leave those four presidents alone. <laughs> Do your presidential thing. You know what I mean, like I said, you did more. You did more talking about Obama than for the people. <laughs> Live global coronavirus news. Listen, man, it is a pandemic. And I, like I said, you don't want to get down to the nit and grit of where it's coming from. So now you got to deal with it. Second stimulus check. Who gets one and who does not? No, everybody needs a check. Right now, like day before yesterday, they needed that. You know what I'm saying? The struggle is real and you only inducing more pain amongst the minorities. Like I said, your, your, your bank accounts flooded already. Cause cause Donald said he was gonna send another one months ago. And you was expecting that, so you spent whatever you had. And then he, he slowed down the process because unemployment hit him. And then he had to pay the businesses back to open again. Man. <laughs> I know you don't want to hear it, but... Someone has to get in there and do the right thing. Google will start paying publishers for news. Oh, man. Everybody, you want to oversaturate my job now. Because I was doing it for free. See, this, this is why. See, see, this is why. Can can I be in my can I be in my zone? Just 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 my little my little zone when I'm doing. Now you wanna pay people to do the news. Now they going now they gonna screw up all of the news. Start making up news and doing all this stuff. And then Trump could win again, saying fake news. Like he did before. Come on, man. Wake up to the, the roses, man. Wake up to the roses. Did I say to myself, you have awoken in something within the world. And people want answers. People want stimuluses. And they want to get back to normal as quick as possible. Now, Friday is right around the corner. Now, I said to you, if you can't open everything by Friday, something must be wrong. Now, can you tell us, Donald? Please. <laughs> ah, man. New research explores how conservative media misinformation may have, wait for it, intensified. You see? I, now, I'm not making this stuff up. But before I read the headline, I already said that that's what's going to take place. You're going to intensify fake unrealistic news because it, it's the only way to combat the reality of the the, the mess. <laughs> get it, get it, get it, bone, sweep it up, clean it up, however you gotta do it, man. But, it's gonna take time to do so because this ain't just a little bit of dust underneath something, man. Oh. You got, oh man, news at a glance. No, we want news and reality time and, and, and real news, man. Sad. And with quarantine, what news you gonna get? <sighs> and seeing as though everyone wants to work behind the news and all that, you know, I know it was something up them little little hands, man. Delivering grim news to COVID-19 patients' families. 
Listen, man. Like I said, Donald says the pandemic is at a minimum. And the news is saying it's at an all-time high. Who do you who do you believe in these times? We're in trouble. Pen penlive.com has that story. And the news we're going to give you isn't good. Well, like I said, get used to this because they want to make it the new normal. But like I said, my fame has become unbearable to the point where the majority of things I do is disliked anymore. You have put me on a black web. You have, you have, uh, I mean, the list goes on and on, man. But still, I manage to keep a smile. With that being said, peace, I gotta go.